everyone welcome back to my channel today I'm doing a quick little haul on the items that I got from runway fashion and basically I was a little apprehensive of, about ordering from there because I have ordered from them so many years ago and I was much younger so I really can't be for sure but it just seemed like my order took forever to come and that's what I saw a lot of people complaining about the shipping length of time so I just was like, hmm, I'm just going to play it safe. So, majority of the items that I ordered were accessories, but I do plan on ordering again. Um, just to give you a little rundown of Runway. It's similar to Shein.com, if you're familiar with that. It's um, very affordable items. Um, a lot of items I would just consider very cheap. They also have um, clothing, shoes. They have, um, I've got bags and accessories. What I didn't notice with Runway is that the shipping time is not what's long. I think um, the issue is they take um, a couple days to process. Like most websites process in like two to three business days. But with them, it can take up to seven days. With my order, it took like I think two days to process it. And then they shipped it out. So I did receive it, my items within a week and a half, week and a half. I think it was less than two weeks. So I wasn't like pressed to get anything. So that's not that bad and the items are um, I think majorly made in China and like I'm um, manufactured in China so um, it makes sense that it took a while to get to the United States but I just want to jump right into this the first items I'm going to show you are the accessories I got and they just came in this separate package um, everything came in like a bigger package but I have since opened that and some of these items I've already worn so I don't know where that package is but it was just a simple um, you know shipping package but my accessories did come in a smaller package within and I'll take all of these out. These are kind of just little tiny items. I, like I said, I wasn't trying to grab a whole lot of things. Just kind of trying to get stuff that I knew that I wanted but wasn't too pressed if it took forever to come. And the first item I got is this ring and I put all the prices in. Hopefully I can find the links for the, the items. I'll put them in my description box. I got this ring here and I think it is so pretty. I want to make sure you can see it. This is how it is. It's like a wire ring and it has these two little balls on it. The first one is kind of kind of like um, has some texture to it and the next one is just a solid gold ball. And I want to wear it on this finger since I always wear my ring here on this finger. But that's how it looks. So it does, I think I'm like a size 8 ring, so it does fit and I think you can adjust it like you can, it's kind of springy so you can make it bigger. But this is like a 8, so I wouldn't say it's made for really wide fingers, but yeah you definitely can adjust it to make it a little bigger. And that's how it looks. The next item I got, and I do like that they had each item individually wrapped. These are some earrings here and it's like a little... It's a small like Ziploc bag that you just pull apart like that and it's just some more gold earrings that's how these look here they're just circular and they're kind of similar to the ring which I didn't buy them to like match but it kind of that little circular springy look and that's how those look. I love post earrings or as I have on today, tassel earrings. Those are my favorite earrings to get. I'm not really big into huge earrings. This is like about, I could go a little bigger than this. But I don't like anything weighing down my ear. I also got a gold necklace and I own like kind of several of these necklaces that are multiple necklaces in one. But I like them because it's just... Instead of having to layer so many necklaces, it's already made into one. This is how the necklace looks. It's like multiple necklaces in one. So the first one is just a simple regular gold necklace. And then this one has like a little crescent on it. I hope that you all can see this. And this one has a little charm, two charms hanging. And then it continues down. Into just one long. I got this little elephant brooch here, and I think it's so cute. And all these items, um, I'm gonna look back at my invoice, but all these were like three dollars at the most, maybe two dollars. And it does have a pin on it, so you can 
pin it onto your shirt or blouse or whatever you're going to wear it with. But I thought that was so adorable and cute. And these items, for them to be very inexpensive, they're not cheaply made. Like, I think that looks like I paid more for it <laughs> than I did. The next item that I got, and this was just a phone case. I really just got it um, just to see um, how it look on my phone. But it's an iPhone. I have the 7 Plus. So that's how it looks. And it's similar to the case that I have on now. Um... This is the case I have on my phone. <laughs> this is the one I bought. So I'm really into like marble and metallics and stuff. But that's how it looks. And it just has this white foam in here to keep it. And it's um, it's a flexible case. It's not going to necessarily protect my phone. It's just really for fashionable purposes, I guess you could say. But that's how it looks. And this case had to be like probably $3, $2 or something. So very inexpensive next item i'm going to show you um this purse now if you follow me on instagram or social media you probably have been seeing it quite often and i wasn't even really expecting to wear this purse as much as i have i think i've worn it two or three times so far but it's just if i don't have a purse or if i don't have an something that i feel like matches an outfit adequately i'll just grab this and i still have stuff in it so don't mind my items in it but i left it in there to show you like the spacing and i mean it's a clip purse so it looks better with something in it but it's just a clear little crossbody off the shoulder purse and it does come with a gold chain with it now these are not like super long so I'm like 5'6", five, 5'7", five, and I really wish the, sh the, um, the purse, what am I, what do you call this, the, the, the chain for the purse, <laughs> the purse strap, I just really wish it was longer. But I just have her like some shades, a little money I had from the weekend, and beauty blender, lipstick, and change or whatever, but that's just how it looks, and it's this... This is like a side view of it. But yeah, it's just a little small simple bag. And I know for a fact this was like three dollars because everywhere I go, people are like, oh, how much was your purse? So I'm always saying that like, it was literally three dollars. For the summer, I'm always into crossbody bags, so that's what I was majorly buying. And I like to get bags that I don't really see people wearing. So I thought this was very unique. It's um what color would this be? Like an emerald green. And it has these little detailings on it. It's like a crosshatch detail. And then it has these little flaps here. They like come up. The purse opens like this. And it has some other miscellaneous junk in here. <laughs> Am I the only one that every purse, when I switch my purse, I just take out the necessary items I need. And whatever's left in it, it just stays in that purse until I use it again. Like, I always do. Like, so if whatever place I went to say my receipts for the day are in this purse but that's how it looks and this was the one I was really talking about the purse strap is super short to me see like I'll insert probably some pictures of me wearing these items or maybe my thumbnail but I was just like mm. this literally comes to my I don't even know if it comes past my hip maybe right at the top of my hip so I wasn't a super a huge fan of that but like I said three four dollars this may have been like seven dollars you get what you pay for so it's not like you're going to get super high-end items just being honest but you will get your money's worth i want to talk about this purse which i have not worn yet but i'm super excited i saw one of my um i saw a youtuber on instagram wearing it and that's really what made me place this order is after i saw her with this purse i was like okay i definitely want that purse and i'm gonna get some other items as well so let me open this up and it's tiny as well, but like I said, before it's the summertime, I'm not trying to carry around huge purses and huge bags. I'm trying to put enough stuff in it and it's comfortable as possible. But this is just like a graffiti type of purse. And I like the yellow and red. Those are my like some of my favorite summer colors. And that's how it looks. It just has a gra graphic right here. And it's like kind of graffiti type of writing. It's gold hardware. It's like... I don't know if you can see, but it's heart shaped. That's kind of cute. And you just pull it open. And this strap is a little short, but I see that I can adjust it. But 
it's like this and I like that's what I really liked about it was the strap of it so I can make it longer that's how it looks and it has yellow here so if I hook it onto the purse I mean it's gonna be short as well but you can always just a little hack you can always get some gold chain from somewhere and connect it to the end of this and then loop that in on here and you can make your um, purse even longer if you do have adjustable and removable straps but the good thing about this is if I wanted to I could wear it as a clutch like I could just wear it like this or I can wear it with the strap hanging or I can wear it with the strap on me so yeah but I guess like if you're shorter then it won't really matter the length of it won't but yeah dude, that's about the longest it will be but yeah all in all I like the purse and I probably will be wearing it soon and it does have a little pocket here so you can put additional items in it and that's how it looks on the inside you give you a free gift with every order so I got this runway bag and let me just open that up really quick and it's just a canvas bag it has the name on the front it has a zipper in the back here so you can put additional items in the back of the little pouch and I probably use this for like makeup or lipsticks or just like an insert in another purse. But it's a good amount of room in here. And I mean, it was free. So I wore these this past weekend. This is the only clothing item I got. Um, they do sell plus size items. This is a 1X. But these are the little black shorts I have. Um, some people asked me about them. They had the lace on the bottom of them. And the sizing is pretty good. You know, sometimes when you buy items that are like china manufacturer items then or coming from china you don't really know what to get as far as sizing goes but these are like a one x and it has stretch to them so i probably could have got away with a xl in them but that's just how they look and yeah i probably will purchase more items and if i purchase more clothing items i'll try to do a try on haul of them and give you my sizing and all this stuff in case anyone has been wanting to purchase from there but that's going to bring us to the end of this video. I hope that you all enjoyed this haul. It was very quick and short and straight to the point. And I'll see you in my next video. Thank you for watching.